bark and no bite. Irma is so cool. Since he lost to us, he'll be waving our toe, won't you? Uh, you leave me with no choice. Now, to show you my true strength. sure we've seen the extent of your abilities in our last race. He seems quite desperate. How frightening. I must say, I quite enjoy these tussles. I feel we've gained an understanding. Then I will pound you silly. Feeling sentimental. You're a real troublesome fellow, aren't you? And a loser to boot. <laughs> Quiet! Gilgamesh, would I be able to ask you something? Why do you always attempt to get in our way? I think we'd all like to know the answer to that. Excellent question. I suppose I could tell you. It would, after all, be a fitting last request. First, he threatened to steal our wheels. Now he's planning to take our lives? No one should ever be stealing anyone else's wheels, dead or alive. Edgar told me about you. Is it true? You're a thief? Who in the world is Edgar? Well then, I guess if we win, we'll be sending you on a one-way trip to... Ha! Uh, uh, about that. Are you not familiar with the concept of trash talk? You shouldn't take what I have to say so seriously. Enough! It's time you put your money where your mouth is. Huh? Right, let's do this! I cannot reveal any names, but I was ordered to prevent you from attending the race at all costs. Sounds fishy to me. Who gave you those orders? I told you I can't say. Don't tell me you just made that up. Yeah, enough with that shit chat. For Gilgamesh, it is morphing time! <laughs> what in the world? He grew four arms! Let's see how good six times a manpower really is.
mad. I could have told you that. You're the boss. Huh? What is wrong with that? But I vanish from the statue. What? No! Anything but that! Say it's Kupo! Kupo? Did you hear Kupo? <sighs> He's disappeared. You think he might be dead? He might still be alive. How do you prove that you exist? Maybe we don't exist. <laughs>